I'm here in Dhaka in Bangladesh, and it's without doubt the busiest place I've ever been in my life. But I'm here to learn that some children here are completely alone. Many of these children sleep rough at Dhaka's Kamalapur train station. Children like Nirob. So Nirob, big question. Messi or Ronaldo? Messi. Or... Messi? Ah, my man. Good lad. The train station, is it dangerous? How, how do you feel at night? At just 10 years old, the horrors Nirop has already faced are unimaginable. Nirob is safe now, thanks to a UNICEF-supported project that is helping children to a life away from the streets. Here they can sleep in a safe place, and they have a chance to be children again. This project has helped thousands of children. But every day, more are arriving. As night falls, I leave Nirob and the others safe at the hub. I went back to the station with Rubel, a project worker who used to live on the streets as a child. He regularly goes out to look for new arrivals. When a child first comes to the streets is when they are most at risk. And it wasn't long before we came across a child that Rubel hadn't seen before. Look. কিছু লাগে না This work is so important, and there are still millions of children across the world who will sleep on the streets tonight. As a parent, I can tell you, this situation would be your worst nightmare. No child's bedtime should have to be on a street at a pavement. So when you put your kid So when you put your kid to bed tonight, please remember that there are kids all over the world who are not as lucky to have you protecting them. So please, please give what you can. <laughs>